million dollar treasure planted somewhere in our state. And in Santa Fe, that means a tourism boom of sorts. Byron Morton takes us to a business that's tasting some sweet success. It's been a little crazy. At the Inn at the Loretto in Santa Fe. Our phones are ringing off the hook. They're cashing in. We have had about, I think, 100 people who booked the package. And it's all part of what's being called the Forest Finn Effect. A pastrami on rye. It's his favorite sandwich. You see, Forrest Finn is the author of this book, The Thrill of the Chase, a book that has clues to the location of a treasure chest. Forrest says he's hidden somewhere in the Rocky Mountain West, maybe right here in New Mexico, which has the Department of Tourism on cloud nine. And it's telling the story that New Mexico is a place of adventure and of treasure. Because when people come to look for gold and jewels, they need a place to stay. So places like the Inn at the Loretto have added a Thrill of the Chase package to encourage those on the gold rush to stay with them. Families who are, um, you know, ready for the adventure travel with their children, it's a great way to get them outdoors, to try to find a real life treasure. And even if you don't find the treasure, you still get a pot of gold here at the Inn at Loretto, which is amazingly delicious. Mm. Not only will you get this chocolate treasure chest full of edible gold and pearls, as a bonus, you get the clues too. People were trying to book the package, but just to get the book. It's a good thing and it's going to have long-term impact and benefit to us as a state. On the Treasure Watch in Santa Fe, by Morton, KOAT, Action 7 News.